that works. Ha! Ah. That works? All right, I'm gonna have to like slouch in order for you to see me. Yeah, so just thought I'd vlog in some nice, peaceful, serene scenery today. I don't really know why, I'm just kind of getting bored of the bedroom. Getting bored of vlogging in the bedroom. So, came out here today in nice, grand, forest where there's a creek behind me. Do you see the creek? Actually, the creek never used to be uh, full of water. It just used to be a drought, so yeah. That's not the real point of this video. The real point of this video is that a while back, Charlotte tagged me in the Liker chain. Oh, Charlotte, always tagging me in everything. Maybe I'll tag you in something. Hmm, maybe. If you don't know what the Liker chain is, the Liker chain was started uh, about 2010 by Charlie is so cool like, and it's been circulating around the YouTube for forever now. Liker chain is probably like one of the oldest and most well-known tags on YouTube. And I'm surprised I actually haven't done this yet. Maybe it's because I'm very indecisive and I can't really narrow down any of my favorite, favorite YouTubers because I have a lot of favorite YouTubers. So I was thinking about narrowing it down to like top five YouTubers who have like influenced me, but then I realized it's just like, uh, well, you know, there are a lot of YouTubers out there who really don't get deserved and well known. So I thought for this Liker chain I'd just make it a compilation of shoutouts to those people who I think are really awesome and deserve more viewings on the tubes. So without further ado, do the Liker chain. The person who I'd like to put first on the list and also the person who tagged me is Charlotte. I've been watching Charlotte for a while now and I've seen- Ah, fly! I've been watching Charlotte for a while now and I've seen her when she first started on YouTube doing monologues and then she eventually became a vlogger and I just think Charlotte has grown so much on YouTube. You can really tell she puts hard work and quality effort into all her videos and vlogs and just everything she does. And also, she's a theater geek, so how can I not put her first on this list? Second person I'd like to talk about who I think also is similar to Charlotte is Time Lords and Wizards. I first started watching her when she had 100 subscribers on YouTube, and that was only a year ago, and now she has a thousand subscribers. And honestly, I can see why she's grown so fast. Her videos are very real, she's a booktuber, and she does some really great reviews. She also made a video that I liked recently that talked about what she likes about herself, rather than all those videos on YouTube seeing people that complain about themselves and their flaws. Third person I like to talk about is Imagine Johanna. Johanna is just a boatload full of creativity. Like the last two people I mentioned, you can tell she puts a lot of effort into her work. I've actually done a video response to Imagine Johanna with the pensive, memory pensive, if you remember that. I'll put an annotation over in the doobly-doo somewhere. I don't care really. I don't really care. Uh, besides Johanna, I'd also like to talk about her um, collab channel, also known as Collabasaur. I've been watching those videos, and I think all the people on that collab channel are amazing. It's a lot different than other collab channels I've seen, and they do a really good mix of different topics. Last person I'm going to recommend to you, because there are a lot of people coming, and I'm scared that one person is going to turn the corner and see me doing this. Last person I'm going to recommend is John of Hard Hat Jello Zenon. I think that's how you pronounce it. I'm not sure. John makes really good vlogs, and he also does a lot of Google Plus Hangouts, so if you catch those, you'll be able to meet a lot of other great YouTubers. And he's just so great. He's always helping to make the YouTube community come together closer and closer. And I am definitely a supporter of that. Once you really dive into the community of YouTube, it makes YouTubing so much more fun. Well, that's all I have to say. Alright guys, I'll see you later or something or whatever. <gasps> oh! No! Oh no, no, there's one more person! Ah! I can't believe I forgot her! Last person I'm recommending is Multicolored Flyfish. Multi, multi, I don't really know how to say that. She's also doing Vita and also her name is Katie! How of the Katie's man, and I really, really enjoy her videos. All her videos just have a really nice, relaxing mood to them. And of course, like everyone else on this list, her videos are really good quality, and she puts a lot of hard work and effort to them. And you should definitely go check out her channel because I think she deserves a lot. All right, guys, I swear that was the last one. Oh, I'm so forgetful. I hate that. I hate when I forget things. I really do. All right, guys. I'll see you later. Mwah. Peace.